Okay, can you just explain one flow, like where you get, uh, for example, you have to print something called welcome or something, from right from the project creation to the uh, view page, like how you do it, the entire thing. So, uh, uh, let's suppose that normally, anyway, in Angular, we will create NPM. Uh, using NPM, we will create a web application. So, for example, let, we're having an inbuilt project. Already, we're having a one project. In that, we need okay. to get. Uh, we will create one component in that particular place. Okay. From there, wha- where we need to decide, let's suppose that we, we're having a routing. So, based on that particular uh, uh, view page, we need to create. I mean, we need to and display. Like not, and like, let us not consider routing, just in a uh, project wherein you are displaying hello there. Ah, normally in a, uh, normally in a component, uh, let's suppose in a while creating a project, that component that HTML will be there. Ah, uh, even then we will, we will display. Yeah, just explain the code flow, like what all the things you need to like, consider from app module. Yeah. Ah, uh, there we will create, like, uh, let's suppose we will create one variable, like something like, like, uh, on X variable we will create. There we will give that uh, message. Ah, uh, let's, uh, let's uh, suppose we will give that message. Ah, uh, from there, uh, what we will do, we will uh, in a, uh, Interpolation in the uh, Azure component of HTML. Uh, if we give that interpolation and uh, that way, in the interpolation, we give that variable, or uh, that output will be displayed. Where do you give that string interpolation? Uh, like uh, double braces? Yeah, uh, in the uh, Azure component of HTML, we can give. Otherwise, we can create some template and we can give. Otherwise, in top itself, the template will be there, right? There we can give. Okay. Uh, like, what is the difference between ng if and, uh, I mean, uh, ng if and issue? So normally, uh, ng if, let's suppose the ng if it will not be in top. Okay. But ng show or ng it will be in top. Based on that condition, it will be whether we can see or we can't see. But ng if it will not be in top. Okay. Which is a st- uh, structural, which will modify the structure here? ng show or ng if? Uh, it's a here ng if. Okay. What about ng show? So ng show is also a structure, but uh, normally, uh, that or uh, they that want to present in in the uh, let's suppose that uh, if uh, they want to don't want to display in that uh, I mean uh, in that uh, condition so we don't want to use that ng show normally we use ng if for ng show but mostly based on the conditions we will use ng if like uh, for validation mostly we will use ng if okay what are services in Angular so normally uh, in Angular uh, we having services to dis- uh, to fetch uh, API services like uh, HTTP client we can use and we can uh, use services for uh, transfer data between two components and uh, uh, suppose we can create integrable services uh, like uh, uh, provided in group. Okay, how do you like to define like, like uh, for example a project you have to include a service, how do you do it in the code? Uh, like, normally what you call that service, define that service on that? Yeah, if it is a single term service, uh, normally what we will do, we will do give uh, yeah, at inject in the inside at injectable the service, we will give provided in root. Okay. It will take the entire application. And okay. if we don't want to use the entire application for particular thing, what we can do, we can use it provider. So it's a single term service, we can use, uh, like uh, we can do provided in root. So in previously what we can do, we can use in that, uh, in that, uh, abroad, abroad here, that, uh, inside that, uh, a uh, provider we can uh, use that plan, like a uh, provider in the DKE. Okay, uh, what's the difference between a root param and query parameter? Uh, normally, uh, query params, uh, for example, uh, based on the condition like uh, support, uh, we having some uh, four or five uh, query queries, like uh, for example, uh, based on that uh, after question mark, if you want to fix something, like one, two, three, four, five, if you give that query, based on that only that, uh, like that, uh, what the DAP call will get, and uh, based on that only we will get that data. And, uh, root parameters? Yeah, uh, root parameters, uh, I forgot it, uh, not with, uh, not with, uh, Between components in Angular? So, uh, normally, uh, normally with the parent child relationship, we will use the uh, uh, input mother, ma'am. If it is a uh, child to parent, we will use the uh, item output and our uh, event emitter method. And uh, uh, if it is no relationship between the components, we will use services. Okay. Uh, can you 
Thank you. 